okay now move your hands also don't touch your ear lobes but feel what's going on you'll feel some heat exchange and there are also vibrations right likewise you will have specific feelings like that at each of this chakra either they become so light it's like someone is tickling you let us see you are so deeply in a state of love for no reason i'm not talking about loving someone or personal love versus impersonal love causeless versus caused love i'm not talking of something for which one has to depend on i'm just saying sometimes your heart feels so overwhelmed with this love within for no reason imagine what happens to you at that time watch the vibrations within your entire body scan your system from top to toe and see where those vibrations are revolving watch that secondly watch when you are so afraid when you are so fearful close your eyes at that time and scan your body and see from or in which part of your body this fear some vibrations are gravitating what is the epicenter of those vibrations of fear epicenter of vibrations of love epicenter of vibrations of contentment epicenter of vibrations related to anger during all these classical moments just focus try to scan your system and see where these vibrations are radiating from then you will find that they have specific location each qualitative emotion has a specific location for example for your understanding i would say that immense love and its opposite anger and hatred uses here the epicenter is almost four fingers three to four fingers above the left nipple and you will always feel that this particular area becomes very heavy when you are angry likewise when you are when you are sexually driven and you are not able to satisfy your sexual appetite that particular chakra is also in the vicinity of the heart i have mentioned how to locate each chakra likewise when there is so much of contentment where you are some people say you are in a buddha field or you have entered into christ consciousness or krishna consciousness or the, these are the very special moments in each one's life at that moment see how you feel within yourself and you will find that content immense peace that you gather within is on the right almost three fingers below your right nipple and if you create the mirror image of that that will be the epicenter of vibrations related to fear now okay, these are all energy vortexes i call them chakras are nothing but energy vortexes which are like epicenter of each emotions in short and they are all uh, they are all experienceable how to feel that what those vibrations are like for example open your palm like this and see if you can take it near your eyebrows but don't touch it and see how you feel at that moment okay now move your hands also don't touch your ear lobes but feel what's going on you'll feel some heat exchange and there are also vibrations right likewise you will have specific feelings like that at each of this chakra either they become so light it's like someone is tickling you or when it is worse for example love versus anger and hatred the vibrations arising at this particular chakra which is almost three fingers above the left nipple you feel so much of vacuum there 
though there will be vibrations, but they are so pleasing, very pleasing, as if someone is tickling you. But when you are angry, the same chakra becomes heavier and you feel like scratching it. And more you scratch it, uh, I think heavier it becomes. But when you become meditative again and try to dissolve these heavy vibrations, then the anger will also dissolve. So this is also a remedy how to uh, regulate our anger, how to regulate our emotions related to failure in love, how you are ditched and how can I survive without my lost love. It's difficult. but. Somehow one can manage to sail through life with such techniques. Mm -hmm.